Alrighty, so this is the fifth time recording this. You may now feel my pain. But this is for a school project. And I'm wearing the appropriate shirt for this. So, there you go. French and British ships line up for the Battle of the Chesapeake with cannons rolls. The beginning of a new dawn in 1781. Nelson and his valiant fleet rough up Napoleon's ships with some good old cannon fire. Uh, God bless his soul. Trafalgar 1804, cry the people with glee. The ironclad smashes her way into history at Hampton Roads, 1862. To hell with Dixie, us Yankees are here to stay. The ironclad makes her mark on history in a glorious fashion. Here in Manila Bay, 36 years hence, Spain and America clash. Cruiser gunfire blasts from the newest in gun technology. Them cruisers battle it out with rage. George Dewey must be a happy man in his victory. War. Uh, here at tail's end of 1914, we hear the ballad of Von at Coronel. Blast him. Germany and Britain in this great war, the war to end all wars, has begun, not with a bang, but with a blast. His, his victory lasts nay longer than a month. With His Majesty's Royal Navy, his battle cruisers here to silence the Honorable Hun's soul. Here at Jutland, they clash at last. Dreadnoughts, the beasts of the waves, have come um, to usher in the new era of the battleship with gunfire and blasts of thunder. Beasts of steel battle it out on the high seas. German and British battleships lead Eve the field, knowing that they have blasted their way into the pages of history like their forefathers in the Age of Sail. Here at Drawback Sound, 24 years after Jutland, here at Norway, these, these countrymen make their stand. Either I will be decorated or I will be court-martialed. Fire. They, the colonel says to his men at the fort, and they fire their guns in the defense of the nation. The night is ablaze with this uh, gunfire and explosions. A German cruiser is sent to Davy Jones's locker. The Second World War has come to Norway. Only three months later, France has already surrendered to German and Italian might. Britain refuses to allow her enemies to gain superiority on the high seas by taking the French fleet and making their move. Here at Burz el Kabir, British battleships and aircraft attack the French, battling it out with rage. The old friendship has gone. Britannia once again rules the waves. November, the night is here. The moon softly, softly gl glistening. British aircraft roar of the... Italian port of Toronto, to later us inspire the Japanese to do the same. They do the damage they can, which cripples the Italian Navy's ability to go head-to-head -head with His Majesty's Navy. Italy wants to try their hand at toppling the British supremacy of the seas here at Cape Matapan, only four months after Toronto. Britannia brings her best to bear. British battleships decisively feat the Italians and wipe the floor with Italian cruisers. Oh, the shame. The shame. Bismarck is here to make her stand. She sinks hood, but Prince of Wales survives. Now the British fleet decide to obliterate Bism Bismarck with her overwhelming firepower. Battleships rage again, but Bismarck's efforts are futile. Today, se December 7th, 1941, a date which will live in infamy. Naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan suddenly and deliberately attacked American forces on the Hawaiian island of Oahu, their main concentration being Battleship Row at Pearl Harbor. Here at Battleship Row, our battleships are here. Eight and all, and in their fine, in their line. Poor Arizona explodes, followed by the subsequent sinkings of four battleships. We will remember. Midway, 
here in June of 42, Ice Yanks strike back. Carriers and aircraft battle it out once again here in the Pacific. American carriers bask in the glory of their victory. Five months since in Smith Edway, we strike back. Guadalcanal will be held and we shall hold on our ground as an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Here we take another tooth. Washington throws down and slams Kirishima and sends her to the bottom of the sea. The American ensign and flies over the Solomon Islands. 25th October, 1944. Here the Americans are knocking at the door. Five of Pearl's battleships have come to fight Japan here at Surigao Strait. Six old battleships under the Stars and Stripes have come to retake the Philippines at last. MacArthur once said, I shall return. And he has in pure American style. Here, Japan has decided to duel the Americans at last. Yamashiro and Fuso oh, are here to fight us Yankees, but they fail to recognize American ingenuity. They are sent down to the bottom, and with this great battle, the end of the, the age is here. The age of the battleship has ended, but her purpose has not faded. She's, and she certainly has never been forgotten. Hope you all enjoyed.